Hey beautiful, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hi, my name is Lexi Jada and welcome. Today I am feeling amazing. So I hope you guys are too. My babies are not feeling so well, so we have been constantly vomit out here, diarrhea, this, this. I'm just like, uh, and I felt like poop as well. I finally feel a little bit better. So I'm like, you know what, let's do a video. I do want to change my shirt though. Cause I feel like when I'm wearing color for shirts, I feel a little bit better, even more. I got this one on clearance, $3.49, originally $6.99 at Ross. Mira, and it says vibes. You know the vibes. Let me lower the, can you guys see it better? Mm -hmm. Vibes. So I'm going to go change that real quick. I just wanted to show you guys. Is that weird that I like showing you guys? before I put something on. There it is, look how cute that is. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So today's video, I wanted to play with some new makeup that I haven't. And I feel like it's been a minute since we've done videos like that. And I have been asked by you guys to please do a makeup video. And I'm like, you know what? I got you. So let's get started into the video. Ahorita, boom. Chica be keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it, keep it. Bing, chica be. So I recently got these in the mail. These are Color RL, my favorite contact brand. And they sent me some really pretty ones. So I was like, you know what? This would be a perfect time to try out some new ones. Halo pair, iris pair, my contacts on my right eye. I'm like a little kid, I have to write this shit down. All right, so we're gonna do the contacts first. And I like to knuckle this Okay, now since like... Jade, why would you be trying to take out your contacts if you just took off your glasses? You're stupid. Oh my God, usually when I have my... <sighs> this is my brain constantly. It's like, what are you doing? God, the people in my brain are probably like, ah, freaking out. Bacteria, bacteria. So I'm gonna do one wit. <laughs> right now oh that's pretty like it makes a difference but it doesn't overpower too much where it's like you look like an alien you know like look at that so with the contact without the contact with without haven't worn colored contacts in a minute look at that that is huge it's like a little difference like not too much but it's enough to get me happy i really can't believe y'all that I really try to take off my contact like a chingona like this. Like, look, at look, this is what I do. Stupid. Okay, so my eyebrows have grown in because I sneezed and I need to get them cleaned up. So I'm gonna go in with a razor and I just like to just go over it like this. Oop, I went too much right there, but that's okay. Oh my gosh, I took off a lot of hair on that one. Oops, I got a little bit too excited. Yeah, holy sh, look at that. I took out a lot, Jada. All right, so now I'm gonna go in with the NYX Thick It Stick It. And if you see this twitching, if you see my eye twitching, my eye is just shaking its ass. It's my stress. So if you see it over there saying hi to you, it's just because of my stress. So we're gonna go in with the NYX Thick It Stick It, and this is in Espresso. So I'm just going to apply. This, I've used it in the clear. Oop, I made a mess. So this one, it's semi-new to me. Like I have used the clear, and I have used this like as like a like a topper, but I have not really like used it by itself. Can you see that? Hell yeah. It's like getting on there really good and coating my eyebrow and really giving me that full nice feathered eyebrow effect to like look at this one and then look at this one this one we kind of beat up with the shaving but we're gonna we're gonna fix her so let's go in with this side it's like super quiet where i feel like i need to blast music but it's super quiet because where my ears have been ringing because like everyone's sick all of that and then to come in here and it's like silence and it's just me talking it's kind of weird to me right now yeah i really like this it like just really just like fills it in and gives you that fake hair illusion and really thicks up your brow. It really thickens it up. Hence the name, thick it and stick it. Nice, look at that. I really like that a lot. Hell yeah, look at that, okay. And then it does dry down a little bit because this one I 
when I moved on to this one, I left this one alone. So filling this one, it did dry down. So hell yeah. So I'm just gonna add just a little bit more. So I'm gonna go in with the Juvia's Place eyeshadow primer. So one of my favorite brushes to use to blend out my eye primer is the Makeup Shack T29. And I really like just to get in there and lightly buff this all over my lid. And I love how it just blends it. There's two palettes that I wanna play with. The new ColourPop Getting Fresh and the Glam Light Cake Palette. For those who are curious what I've been using for eye cream, it is my Drunk Elephant. And it really does brighten up underneath your eye and really does a really good job. Then I like using my Drunk Elephant. This is the Proteini and this is so good to hydrate your freaking skin. It makes it look nice. If you are having trouble with your foundation, your concealer or your makeup just like looking really cakey or looking very just not so good where it looks like very textured, it could be because one peach fuzz or because you are not doing skincare. Skincare is really important. So make sure that you are applying a base moisturizer. Your primer is not enough. You need moisturizer. I don't care if you're oily. I don't care if you're dry. I don't care if you are normal skin. You need a moisturizer. It feels so weird doing makeup tutorials like this because I haven't done one in for like a long time. And I'm like, do you guys even like them anymore? I feel like, I don't know. I feel like a lot of people are like shying away from it now. And I feel like a lot of my fam bam too are shying away from it. So y'all let me know so I can do what you guys want me to do. So here is the new ColourPop Get In Fresh. I really love how the back is holographic. Is that how I said? I don't know, but I like how it looks. <laughs> and then you open it up. Ding, 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 ding. And here are the colors. I'm going to fix the contrast so you guys can see because it's a little like bright because of all the lights. It kind of washes it out. But these are pretty. Going with the Makeup Shack T45, I am going to pick up open we're gonna pick up open which is this shade right here and we're just going to lightly pick that up i'm going to focus that right here i'm just going to just lightly blend that in so dab and then lightly blend dab lightly blend and you can set your base if you feel like the colors blend a lot better that way but I used to set my base a lot. Sometimes I do when I'm like on the go and I'm just going to use one solid color. I don't normally set my base anymore. So crazy how like different makeup things change, huh? So I have a shopping haul that I wanna show you guys. I recently went to Target because I was on freaking TikTok and I feel like anytime anyone is trying on clothes from TikTok, especially clothes, like workout clothes, I'm a bitch for that. I'm like, uh-huh, I, I want that, I want that. And I'll literally do what I have to do around the house because you know you can't leave unless you do something. And I will go, I will go. And it sucks because Utah sometimes doesn't really have everything that like California does or Texas. And it's so freaking annoying because it's like, I wish they were all on the same page and would stock everything at the same time so everyone felt included. All right, so I'm gonna go in with the Sona Kashuk. I always thought these brushes were so cool. Just have Sona Kashuk. And this is just a blending brush. Haven't used it. I think it's so cute how they come with like the covers. Super cute. Before, these used to always go and sell at Target. I don't know if it's cause like everyone knows that like what day they mark things down. But I remember I used to buy like kits. Do y'all remember that? When I used to buy the brush kit. This one is hands down. So I'm just going to just keep blending those two in. I'm still not sure what the hell I'm going to do, but I want to do something. I want glitter. You know how sometimes glitter just makes you feel, you know what I've been wanting to do? <gasps> We're not gonna even do that. I've been wanting to wear like something like holographic. You know how people have been putting like black and then they put like the really pretty shimmery color. Ooh, I've been wanting to do something like that. I feel so different doing my makeup videos versus my story time. I feel like with my makeup, I gotta be a little bit more profesh. I don't know, is that weird? I feel like with my story times, I'm like, mm-hmm. And then this, mm-hmm, like I can be more open. I don't know. I think too much. I feel like with my story time, I've been able to open up a lot with you guys and it's so crazy how a lot of you guys understand my weirdness and I'm like, yeah, that's, 
that's how I am. Oh my gosh, you guys, I forgot to tell you. We went shopping for my comadre because she is preggers. Oh my gosh. And she's about to give birth to the baby any day, any day. Any day the baby's gonna be here. So me and the baby went shopping and we couldn't just give her the baby, you know? We had to get for my god baby too and the other babies too because I just feel like it's just so rude them opening the gift and there's nothing for them. Like what the f you know? So we went shopping for the babies too. I'll show you guys that in my vlog. I'm gonna start vlogging, I need to. Like pull me by my hair and what you gotta do. But I need to start vlogging because I am tired of me. Like I'm so sick of me. Let's go in this color. This one is soft launch. So anyways, we went shopping. Oh, there was so much cute baby stuff, you guys. I was like, oh my gosh. Everything is so cute. I can't wait for her to put it on the baby. I am going to be gushing all the way from over here. I love baby clothes. And then I picked out some outfits for my niece as well because oh, they were just so cute. Once I show you guys my niece, you guys are like, oh my goodness, she's so little. She's so freaking cute too. So freaking adorable. But I thought I was gonna get like super baby hungry. I only got like a little baby hungry looking at stuff. But I think I'm all right. I think I'm all right. Especially cause how I was like throwing up my freaking guts and I thought I was gonna like, I usually throw up and pee and feeling nauseated. I was like, oh, okay. I re Yeah, I remember this. I literally thought I was pregnant, took a test and everything. Came back negative and I was like, what the? It's just going around. A lot of you guys are messaging me like, Jade, it's just going around. And Loki, I was kind of like, okay, okay. Cause I feel like if I were to get pregnant again, y'all, I'm gonna be such a crybaby. Like I'm telling you now, I'm telling you now, future Alexis, if you get pregnant, you are gonna be such a crybaby. You just are, I am. I feel like as I've gotten older, I'm more emotional. And I feel like if I were to get pregnant again, it would, it would be a girl. I feel like it would be a girl. I don't know why, I just feel it. I just feel like it would be a girl and she would be on Team Rudy. Just how baby Jade is. Jade, sick of me. Unless she is sick, like cause she is now and she's like, mom, come here mom, come here mom. But other than that, she's full on daddy's girl. You would think he birthed her because how close they are. Yeah, she don't give a damn about me at all. Only when she's like not feeling good, then she's like, okay, I have to be nice to the lady. <sighs> come here, come here, come here. But other than that, she gives no Fs about me at all. That is pretty, you guys. That color combination is gorgeous. So I explained this, I think in a Facebook Live. Oh, speaking of that, I need to go live on Facebook too. I get annoyed with me now, like, oh, I have to do it. Like more like, oh, because I said I was going to do it. And then I, oh, I'm sick of me, y'all. I'm sick of me. Anyways. I remember telling you guys, I think it was on Facebook. Our eyes are not twins. Our eyes are not gonna be symmetrical. There is God's favorites out there, of course. But if you guys notice, this one I can blend like, okay? And this one's a little bianch and she doesn't blend as well. So I have to take a little bit more time with her and go back in there and show her a little bit more loving. I feel like sometimes when we see people do makeup, especially online, a lot of editing goes into how much time actually, how a lot of editing goes into how much time we take from like, okay, it might take us 15 minutes to blend, but all you guys see is a one minute clip of us blending and you're probably thinking like, damn, it only took one minute, why does it take me so long? Because it actually does take longer, babe. It's just because of editing in social media, it's very easy to kind of like trick the mind and thinking like, oh damn, like they did it so flawlessly but in reality, it's just editing. Sometimes I have to get off social media myself because I be looking at these really beautiful women with their freaking culos and I'm just like, <laughs> you're gonna squat 50 more today, 50 more. Like it says right here, I've been recording for 23 minutes. I'm probably gonna upload this and it's not gonna show the full 23 minutes of me blending my eye, right? Take it into consideration, bib. There's like two greens in here, but I want to use that green that I told you that is going to shift the color. The mend, wow, those colors are very, very similar. Oh, one's like a darker, one's more like a lighter, but it's still not like the color that I want. I want more of like a shape shifter. Why is your eye shaking, Alexis? I don't know, because of stress? No, because of caffeine, bitch. Oh, sh okay. I'm going to use this. This is from Caddy London. This is a shadow flip. Romanatic, supersonic. Okay, this is the color, Mira. Like, look how it just shifts, okay? 
And then that beauties are putting eyeshadow on top of that. And I was like, oh, what? So I was like, okay, so I'm just going to apply some like this on my lid. And then, let's see. See, I like how that looks. Funny story. That's cute. Funny story. And I was gonna go back over here. Oh, dang, I added a little bit too much. I added a little bit too much. I want to use these glitters. These are from ColourPop. This is the Glitter, Glitterly Obsessed. Now I'm gonna go in with a little bit of these. They are so pretty. It's stars. And I'm just going to add just a little bit on top. Like that. And I like to go in with my Olary brush. Olary. I'm gonna go in with this side, pick up some concealer, and then I'm gonna cut it halfway. I do wanna go in with the point, which is the shade right here. I didn't even use the other palette like I wanted to. I was just playing with this one so much. <laughs> Next time. Yeah, I like how that looks. Really takes the look up like a notch, you know? Where it's like, ooh, beach. Yep, I like that. Okay, so I love how it looks. Should I just leave it or add some eyeliner? I should just leave it, huh? Like, it just looks nice like this. Oh, I love it. It makes me happy. Okay, I really like how it looks, so I'm going to leave it. I did get a package in the mail, and it is this. This is the new Lancome Serum Infused Vol Volumizing Mascara. Infused mascara by Lancome, combining our lash expertise and skincare authority for instant sculpture volume that revitalizes lashes over time. The result is full body plush lashes with eight out of 10 women feeling stronger, healthier. Well, I hope I'm one of those eight out of the 10 because I hate when I'm like, I'm at 2%. Anyways, this is how it looks. Focus, why the, is trying to focus on my makeup. It's really, it's really happy. So this is how it looks. It looks so freaking cool. Like I'm not gonna lie, look at it. It's a little curvy. Okay. So you already know I got baby lashes, but I still like using mascara for my bottom lashes and still for my top to coat them. So let's see how it looks. Okay, I'm looking straight. Those are my lashes. Let's see if it does something. I like that it's not like a wet formula where it's like everything starts to clump. Like when I'm applying, it's separating them. It's doing a little something. It's working with what it's got. I like how it looks so far on here. I know they look tiny, don't judge them, okay? But it did separate them and give them a little oomph. Dios forgot to give me a little huh of lashes. I hadn't received a package from Makeup Shack in a minute. So when I seen this, I was like, wait, what the, what the? They sent me some backup of the makeup wipes. They are really, really good. They sent me my favorite lash glue. If you guys want a really, really good lash glue, the Makeup Shack is amazing. And then they sent me a really nice sponge. I think I'll use that one. I already got this one wet. We'll see. So these are the two lashes that they sent me. I think these are new because I haven't seen these in their line. Or they're probably like, bitch, switch it up with your lashes. Because when I when I like a pair of lashes, I will wear outwear them, okay? You ever give me something, I will outwear it. You don't even worry. If you use code AlexisJada, you can save some monies on the makeup shack. So I'm going to use that one. While my lashes are chilling for a little bit, I do want to try this. This is the Revolution Lip Plumper Maximum. <gasps> Dang, it's like oozing out. Oh. So this is how my lips look. Let's see if it does make them bigger. The lashes look beautiful and I feel like they don't take too much from the look. Like they look really pretty. They just give it just enough. Are they getting bigger or am I tripping? So I'm gonna go in with the Essence Hello Good Stuff Face Primer. I'm gonna go in with some of these and some of this. It smells good. It smells good. Do I gotta shave my mustache? You sure do. So I did want to apply this one just because I got it on sale and I haven't used it. So this I got for $2.99, the CoverGirl Soft Honey. I had to take that off. I don't really like lip plumpers that make my lips feel like they're on fire because it makes me just wanna go like this. And I don't wanna be doing that. <laughs> so I'm gonna send that one to my mom because my mom loves lip plumpers. I don't know why. Ever, ever since I was younger, we would go into the mall and she would get these ones called Mother Pucker and she loved it. I'm going to apply this all over. Ooh, this one in particular reminds me of my mama. 
The smell, my mom for sure. Especially the compact, mi madre. So my story times, I know a lot of the times I am really upset with my mom, but I hope you guys know that I really do love my mom. And we have gone through a lot, but I do love my mama. And even though there was a lot of coulda, shoulda, woulda, we are healing and that's my mama. I love her. I am still healing, but I'm okay. And I love my mom a lot. Natural lightweight coverage that feels and looks fresh. Won't clock your pores. It definitely feels like I have a fresh face, like my fresh, my fresh, my face, <laughs> my face, my face does look like it's hydrated like it looks like it has like water like i don't look like a dried bitch you know i look rejuvenated i feel like this is going to be for the days where i don't want too much coverage i'm just going to just bounce this in my face and i'm using the other girl 108 so i'm gonna go into my concealer this is black radiance hd corrector and i grabbed the shade yellow brightness I need help with what makeup to play with you guys. If you could please leave down below what product, whether it be new, old, what products to use. I would greatly appreciate it. And I'm going in with the Pacifica Liquid Cover Full Coverage. This is my favorite. And this is in shade 12 N. M. It was my fa it's my favorite where I have to put it away because I will continue to use it to the point where it's like I'm not using anything else and it's quite annoying. When I like something a lot, I will use it, use it, use it, overuse it, use it, use it, and then lightly just tap that in. So I did pick this up as well. This is a NYX Born to Glow. I love the concealer. I grabbed it in the shade Mocha and I got it for a dollar. Do you guys see that? A dollar. Dollar. A dollar? Yeah, yeah. Always look at the makeup and clearance. They usually have it in the back. They usually have it like in the guarding section. They have it where not a lot of people are going to like look. Even though they're trying to get rid of it, I don't know why they wouldn't put it where everyone can look. But they very, very not so often have it where the makeup's at, where you think they would, right? But in my area, they always have it like in the gardening section, which is weird. I always find some like good deals over there. I'm always like, hell yeah. I'm trying out this new deodorant and it's not working. Yeah, I'll tell you right now, it's not working. It is not working. I keep trying to think like, is it me? Yeah, who else is in here? Who? Nadine, it's just you, Cochina. Just cause like I'd be stressed sweating. Like what am I stressing about right now? I'm just applying makeup. I like to apply all my creams before I set anything with the powder, just in case it lifts or makes any mess, anything like that. I'm going to go in with my Perfusion Blush Soft Matte Liquid Blush. This is amazing. It is amazing. This one is in Mai Tai. Hopefully I said that right. I said it with confidence, so hopefully it's right. And this is how it looks. Look how pretty. And it comes in this little sponge. How cute. And it is really pigmented. I was like, damn. It looks really good. And I love peach. You guys already know I love freaking peach. I went to the store to see if I can find a backup. I know, I know. I said I wasn't going to do it, y'all. But I was like, okay, one for my purse. When, you know, if we go traveling. And one for here. And there wasn't. And I was like, that's Jesus telling you something. I swear. I used to always get mad when my mom would be like, it's Dios. It's Jesus, it's Dios, it's God, you know, I'd be like, but now I'm over here saying it, también. and every time I say it too, I kind of just like smile to myself, like I'm like, it looks like I'm farting, but I'm like, because it just reminds me of my mama. So I'm just going to just tap that, blend that in, a C, and I'm using a LA Girl 108, I use this for foundation, I use it for contour, whatever, and it works. Use code Alexis10. I really do appreciate when you guys use my codes, I appreciate you guys so freaking much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You guys are seriously so freaking awesome. Whenever I get like, sh when people are like, your friends are only online. Uh, so? Friends are cooler than yours, bitch. Yours are in real life and they don't even show up for you. My fam bam does, bitch. Anyways, let's be nice, be nice. I'm gonna go with my Pretty Vulgar. 
and I'm just going to just set my whole face. Okay, so now I'm gonna go in with the new ColourPop Matte Bronzer, Silver Strand Beach, and let me tell you, it blends really good. Look how nice that looks. It gives it like such a nice, oof. I don't even know how to explain it. It's just so nice. Like it's just pretty. Like it doesn't look like orange. It doesn't look bad or anything like that. It just looks very, very pretty. Like sun kissed, like a beach glow. So I'm gonna put this in the inner right here and then the brown on the out. I see. Mm -hmm. I like that, okay. And we're going to pick up that shade right there. And we are going to pick up this one right here, which is hands down. So I'll be right back. We will finish the lips. Ah, and our hair is done. That sound like I let out a pedo, but I didn't, I promise. So I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of my Bile Silk. Guys, back in the day when I was like super chiquita, my mom would get Bile Silk. She was always taking care of her hair. I think I miss my mommy. So this is new to me. This is the Revlon Coconut Restore Fixing Spray. Set and refresh the skin. And I really like how that foundation, where is it at? I already lost it. How my skin looks like good, you know? It doesn't look too matte. It looks rejuvenated. I feel good right now. So I'm still gonna ride this. And then it's all gonna catch up to me at night. I'm gonna be like, hey. Okay, let's see. Oh, that looks like a cool bottle. The mist is nice. Ooh, that smells good. Even though I don't like coconut, it smells good. It smells like summer on a beach. Love it. I really like the nozzle. That's like really nice. It's not like if it's spit in, spitting in my face. It's just like a nice like ha, ha, ha. And if you want to, you can just even press it into the skin. I like doing this, especially if I have like a lot of powder on my face. I love how it just sets the face. Y'all, I'm really liking this look right now. Like, Okay, now we're gonna go in with the Lancome Mascara and apply it to our bottom lashes. That thing is like thick. Like if you throw this at somebody's head, it's going to do some damage. Or even if it drops on your pata, uy, su puta madre, it's going to hurt. Oh yes, I like how it looks on my bottom lashes. So if you have long lashes on top, unlike me, you're going to love the formula because it's really nice and it's very buildable. Like look at my bottom lashes. It's making my bottom lashes look like they're, look at that, and they're just like saying hi. This thing, ooh, look how cute the bottom lashes look, guys. Super cute. This is the one I wanted to use. This one is the, from Star Wars. This one is the Doc Lord. Look how pretty that is. Look how pretty it is. And I wanted to use it with y'all. So that's what we're gonna use. And if anything, we can add a little like ha 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 on top. I really like how this looks, you guys. My nose itch, sorry. Sorry about that. I'm freaking weird, that's why I can't have friends. <laughs> that's why I can't have friends. Cause they always used to be looking at me like, why are you always doing some weird shit? Oh. So we're gonna use the NYX Nutmeg. Now we're gonna go with the Dark Lord. Guys, that color is gorgeous. My fin that her ass was like, it's gonna ruin the sides. It didn't. It didn't, Jade. You're not on this. Oh, that did not look right. This looks so freaking pretty. I really, really, really like how this makeup looked. I was really like, oh, I don't know if I'm gonna like it. And now I love it. Boom. Mm. Finished look. I really love how it looks. I really like it. I feel so pretty right now. I really like it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please make sure to give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already to keep updated with my videos. If you guys want, you guys can follow me on my Instagram, my Snapchat, and my Facebook if you guys want to. I love you guys so freaking much. And this was so fun spending time with you guys and playing with makeup. And ooh, ah, and I really love how this came out. It just feels really pretty, like galaxy vibes. I don't know. I really, really like it, you guys. I really like how it came out. Besos a todos, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. I love you guys. Bye.